This movie is filled with twists and turns and surprises, and I think one of the biggest ones in the very beginning is finding out that I, this sweet girl who just loves the color pink, is responsible for an incredible crime, which is pushing Kamuda's son off of a roof. Um, and so when Kamuda is coming on the train to find the person responsible for this, the very last person he expects to be so twisted and dark and capable of something so horrible is this sweet looking young girl who just looks like a nice college student. Um, and so I think that's what Prince is so good at. She knows that she's underestimated and she also knows that that's an advantage to her. So she uses her sweet looks and her tender voice to get her way and get what she wants and it, gets her into a lot of trouble, but also gets her exactly where she's looking to go, which sometimes is trouble. I've got a lot of scenes with Andrew Koji that ramp up emotionally and that have a lot of stakes to them, which is so much fun because Andrew's character, Kimura, is so like disturbed and upset and just like stressed the whole time. And it's just so, so like down and just distraught. And my character, Prince, could not be having more fun with that fact, could not be more excited that this man's life is falling apart in front of him, which is why it's so interesting to play a character like this. I get to play around with emotions and with just different kinds of feelings that I don't, I've never had before. And it's really, quite fun. Um, but our scenes together vary so much from just brutal emotion and just like just heartbreaking stuff to being absolutely hilarious and um, everything in between. So we have a lot of range, our characters, me and Andrew go through a lot of stuff together, but he's such a great scene partner and we have so much fun. And Every time I step on this set as Prince, I know it's gonna be a great day because I just, this character could not be more fun to play. It is so just exciting to embody her. I, of course, knew who David Leach was before coming to this. I'm a big fan of him. I think it's so, like, what an amazing transition going from a stunt choreographer and a stunt coordinator to then, like, one of the coolest action directors ever. He's so smart and, He's so calm, cool, and collected. And being able to watch someone who has just the weight of the world on their shoulders, like a movie like this, there's so much stress and so many moving parts that go with it. And he just has like the most chill demeanor, always down to joke around and chat with you if you're there. Like he's really, really something else. It's awesome to watch him do his job. It's pretty incredible being able to film on this set. The the way they built the train and and everything. I've actually been on a bullet train, uh, took the exact same path from Tokyo to Kyoto. And so it was kind of crazy when I first got this script because I was like, oh my God, I just did this. Like I just went here. Um, and so I have to say like this train is exactly the same as basically the one that I was on. And it's so cool to see all the details in the train and all the details and everything. We've got the awesome LED screens with the city lights going by. It is such a beautiful, intricate set for how small it is and how limited it is. It just blows my mind at the attention to detail. Brad is so um, just everything that, you know, you imagine and hope Brad Pitt to be. He's like the nicest person. He's so professional, so wonderful to everybody on set. Um, and just really fun to play around with in scenes. You know, he he's really a great scene partner in the way he just, if you have an idea, he's like so excited to try it and to like play with the scene with you. And if he has an idea, it's really fun to just collaborate with him and see where, what he wants to do and where he wants to go. He's just all in all, I would just say a really chill dude. And I'm so excited and thankful that I get to be part of this movie with him. What do I think people will like about this movie? I think people, uh, uh, what the hell is there not to like about this movie? Um, we've got so much. I think the greatest thing about this movie is it's obviously action-packed, obviously has incredible fight sequences and like great action, but my God, this movie is so funny. <laughs> This movie is going to be so funny and I cannot wait to see the way David so brilliantly does marry comedy and action together in this like beautiful harmony that's just going to be hopefully everyone's favorite film because filming it sure has been one of my favorite experiences.